No, when you come across real knowledge, it should be plain and simple. Everybody and their mama is making randomized numbers. You know what a randomized number is? And they say, oh, does that mean that it's tri-merged? So if somebody can't tell you the difference between a randomized number, an age-appropriate, a DMF, a PCN, they don't know what the fuck they're talking about. I'm gonna repeat that. If they don't know the difference between a randomized number, an age-appropriate number, they don't know what the fuck they're talking about. They're making numbers out of crack of their ass, signing up for a counseling. If they get lucky, then it's a good number. And no problems are gonna come creep up with you later on. If they can't guarantee that, they don't know what the fuck they're talking about. They're just selling you something. Period. saw that quick, that quick scheme, that quick cash, that gimme, gimme, gimme energy and they got your ass. For educational and informational purposes only, entertainment purposes only, you understand that? Least six figures, least six figures. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Now, I'm gonna get to a few things I'm gonna, I'm gonna explain to y'all. Um, peace and blessings to you, of course. We made it to the new year, nothing happened to you. You still here, understand? So you, you wanna keep building like there is a tomorrow. I talk about that all the time. There is a tomorrow and you wanna keep building like there is a tomorrow, period. Now, understand the difference between credit, good credit, trying to be private, people using their corporate partnership numbers, CPNs, all these things, um, PCNs, all these things. Understand that when it comes to privacy, Let's talk about this privacy when it comes to privacy notice especially today wealthy companies different banks you know different private banks understand in order to have privacy or private account now you got to have a gang of money now see so in order to operate as a private individual you know you got to have tens of hundreds of thousands of thousands of dollars into this bank or into this institution for them to consider you private and private means that nothing's going to be reported it's all in-house you know what i mean you're actually doing business as with that bank or institution like a family they don't go tell everybody else or go tell the irs and go all this so to date you got to have you know you have to spend a certain amount of money to get that privacy or have that amount of money floating around in their accounts with that you know with that bank or whatever in order to be considered private so understand i've been really showing you guys for a few years now how to be private whether you understand it or not certain registrations is how to be private in order to get yourself out of using your social security number and start using your private taxable numbers and stuff like that you understand that's also privacy so when it comes down to getting to the money, saving money, building wealth, all these things, building your credit, you know, getting these trade lines, all these things, you got to have an understanding, especially for longevity, is privacy. You got to understand privacy. So I've been kind of teaching this slowly but surely. Repetition is the mother and father learning. So I've been reprimanding you, repeating things, hitting you upside the head with this knowledge over and over again. And I want you guys to start paying attention. Lots of lots of people are now successful. 90, 98% of the people I've dealt with got their success and they gone. You know what I mean? Uh, so understand for you, if it's your first time here, make sure you subscribe. Make sure you understand that you're in the right place. Make sure you understand that I know what I'm talking about. I'm a lawyer. I'm not your lawyer. Understand big difference. We haven't signed an agreement. I, Currently, I'm not representing you. You ain't paid me a dime. So since you ain't paid me a dime, it's just talk at the end of the day. But understand, I know what I'm talking about. When you hear me talk, you understand the difference between OG-ness and BS. You understand? Golden plastic. You understand? So welcome to Elite Six Figures. This is the golden mentor talking to you. Understand, I see life through golden lenses. Very important. I see all the ins and outs. I know what's good, what's bad. I have a 
wealth of knowledge, a wealth of knowledge. This is wisdom talking to you. This is universal ancestor information talking to you at the end of the day. So you got to take it serious. Understand, I talk about this all the time. So here's some information that I'm going to repeat. There's always two people at your doorstep, right? One. They are there at your doorstep on purpose to do harm to you and your family. They trying to kill you on purpose. They're on a mission. They got instructions to come get you. That's the first person at your door. The second person at your door, they got a smile. They got a discount. They have lack of knowledge. They gonna accidentally harm you and your family, not on purpose. They bad. Oops. What's the difference? You got to understand both of those people should be treated as your enemy. Understand that. So a person purposely trying to get you or a person accidentally trying to get you or accidentally trying to misinform you. They don't know any better. That's all they know. All they know is how to teach you how to scam, to get in trouble, to jeopardize your freedom. All with a discount and a smile. All for $2.99. So understand, real knowledge, especially this new year, going forward, real knowledge ain't cheap. Ain't no shortcuts to success. Y'all should know it by now. Tomorrow is promised to you. And even if you believe it ain't, you have to build and you have to invest into the thing that you wanna do like there is a tomorrow. You gotta invest, you gotta start planning for 2026. You gotta start planning for 2025. You understand? Stop the yolo in. You got multiple opportunities in life, but you gotta make take it serious today and move forward. You gotta build like there is a tomorrow. Life ain't short, life is long. I'm here to remind you that life is long. Life is amazing, but what you do today dictates and creates your opportunities and shortfalls tomorrow. So a hesitation today seals the deal on your failure tomorrow, period. Your ability to, to put your priorities in, in order and say, hey, I'm gonna value this. I'm gonna spend my time. I'm gonna spend my money. I'm gonna spend my efforts in getting this stuff set up to date. You're creating success and opportunity tomorrow, period. No ifs, ands, or buts. When you call and talk to anybody about helping you with your financial, but with your mind and knowledge, you're gonna know if they know what they're talking about or not, period. Are they just trying to sell you something? Or do they have golden knowledge to give you? Understand, it ain't cheap. When you come across real information, it ain't cheap. You can't waste time and play games. So, as I said, credit is just one slice of the pie. Credit is always one slice of the pie. Your mind, this is some stuff that we need to talk about. Your mind is going to dictate how you see opportunity. Your mind could close the door on opportunity or your mind can open the door on opportunity. The things you say, the words you use, are you creating success? Are you creating failures and roadblocks and problems with what you say? Understand that. So you're the dictator of your success or not. Are you capable, if somebody hands you success, are you able to accept it, follow directions and execute or not? Or are you in your feelings? You dictate that. You understand? You're in control. When you get, you know, when you come across real knowledge, it should be plain and simple. Now, trade lines. Understand trade lines. Trade lines. Understand criteria. If you're going for apartments, you may need one. Sometimes you, you don't need any, but you may need one or two small ones. That's it. When, you, when it comes to getting a place to stay on your corporate partnership numbers or CPNs, you just need one or two. When it comes to credit cards, that's when you're going to need 
six or seven or more. You're gonna need two to three primaries and at least six or seven authorized users when it comes to credit cards. When it comes to personal loans, you're gonna need a lot more. You're gonna need an ID. So when you create your entities, you're gonna already have to have some legitimate identification. You understand? Or somebody who know how to make scannables. Let's keep it a buck for educational and entertainment purposes only. Scannables. When it comes to loans and credit cards, that's when you're gonna need way more. When it comes to buying a car, again, if you can get a trade line that show that you paid a car off or you had you know, one of those auto trade lines, then you won't be considered a first time buyer, right? If you have a auto trade line you understand? If you can get those auto trade lines, you won't be considered a first time buyer. You'll get a car like that. Car key is going to drop into your lap. Quit. If you don't have that on your record already, or some installment loan, because car loans are installment loans. So understand the criteria is two different things. Revolving credit needs certain things. Revolving credit is credit cards. You pay it, you know, you borrow some money, you pay it back. It's right there for you to keep using it. A revolving door. Those you need six or seven authorized users and definitely some few, a few solid primaries. Not not self-lender, not no couple couple hundred dollar accounts. You're gonna need some big boy accounts period for revolving for them to not ID you and check you and all this other stuff. And when you looking thin, that's when they ID in, but just because they ID you don't mean that's something negative, but if they run you through that SSA check, cause you put citizen, cause your, cause your account thin and all that. Well, there's remedies to that. You will not hear that on, on the internet. Can't. Y'all know the number already. I'm tired of, tired of telling it to you. I get a thousand text messages a day. Now, I get a couple hundred. Takes time to weed through those. See who playing. See who fishing. See who nervous. See who hesitating. Come on now. See who got scammed before and they don't want to get scammed again. As if that's my burden. Well, if you'd have came here in the first place, you wouldn't have got scammed. <laughs> if you'd have got the golden knowledge from Master Bob, you'll be well on your way. But you want it the quick way. You saw somebody flashing money and you didn't even listen to their verbiage. You didn't know. You didn't even pay attention to, to, to that. You didn't know what the fuck they were talking about. You just saw that quick, that quick scheme, that quick cash, that gimme, gimme, gimme energy. And they got your ass. And now you're running to me to fix it. We all got to learn. We all learn. But that's your, your learn. So understand, revolving credit, different criteria. Installment loans, different criteria. So if you're trying to get a place to stay, that's a little easier. If you're trying to get credit cards, you got to jump through a few more hoops. If you're trying to get a loan or, or you know, some sort of cash loan, a lot more hoops. When you want to open a business and stuff like that with it, there's other things you need to do. That's where the money at. When you get to the little money, you spend that money to get to more money. There's no help. I got some money and I made it. And I don't got to spend no more money. You're always going to have to spend money till the day you die. You're going to have to spend money until the day you die if you want to get money, period. Wealthy people know it. Rich people already know. In order to get money, you got to spend money. If you want to get your business to be approved for hundred thousand dollars, you're gonna probably have to spend about five to ten thousand dollars. The more you spend, the bigger your net is. Unfortunately, everybody and their mama is making randomized numbers. When I ask somebody when they call me, do you know what a randomized number is? And they say, Oh, is that means that it's tri-merged? I know they know they don't know what they're talking about. 
So if somebody can't tell you the difference between a randomized number, an age appropriate, a DMF, a PCN, if they can't give you any knowledge of that, they don't know what the fuck they talking about. I'm going to repeat that. If they don't know the difference between a randomized number, an age appropriate number, a DMF, a PCN, if they don't understand the differences between those, they don't know what the fuck they talking about. They're making numbers out of crack of their ass. They're, they're signing up for accounts and if they get lucky, then it's a good number. If they don't have real deal opportunities to do a federal and state scan background check on a number to make sure it's clean and no problems are going to come creep up with you later on. If they can't guarantee that, they don't know what the fuck they talking about. They just selling you something. Period. If they can't have an Einstein conversation about how to live your life privately using private numbers versus public numbers, if they can't explain that, they don't know what the fuck they talking about. Why you keep giving them your money? Probably because you don't know what the fuck you talking about. Unfortunately, you want quick money, but you don't know what the fuck you talking about. Ain't no quick money. Either you get it right or you get it wrong. Either you legal or you illegal. Either you care or you don't care. Freedom is priceless. Knowledge, golden knowledge is priceless. Longevity is the plan and that's what you need to understand. Everybody ain't their mama don't know what they talking about. They pop up with a handful of money. That's temporary. Have they lived their life? Have they been through the ups and downs of life and understood, oh, I have a wealth of knowledge to share and to and to get across to the community. Do they have that or not? In the first six seconds of talking to somebody, talking to somebody you should already know that your discernment should be on 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 reek your discernment should be on reek so understand we don't got time to waste you can't call me if you're willing to waste time you don't got it you don't got it go get it act like you a crackhead and go figure it out Crackheads are broke. Crackheads don't got no money. But I bet you, I bet you to get that next hit, they'll figure it out. Give them 15 minutes. They'll come up with it. That's how you supposed to be about your success. Stop limiting your success and who you are. Get up and go figure it out. You understand? Get up and go figure it out. Ain't no shortcuts. Ain't no cheap way to nothing. Cheap way don't work. It's either the right way or the wrong way. It's either the, the correct way or the scam way. It's either the peace of mind, no worries, scot-free way, or scams, getting in trouble, hesitation, fear, here come the popos, fake ID, and all that. When you understand a legal PCN, you, you eliminate the need for a fake ID because you legitimate now. If you want to do a, you know, if you want to use a different name well, you can DBA and do a legal name change, not just any name change, a special name change. You can use whatever name you want. You can get IDs in whatever name you want with the correct name change within a few weeks have a new ID. But you too busy trying to do it the cheap way. You too busy running after the scammers, the niggas who don't know what the fuck they talking about. You love them niggas. You love them niggas. Hey, shouts out to them niggas. But I'm not one of them niggas. 
a master Bob with at least six figures who gonna teach you how to do it the correct way. Keep you and your family and your loved ones out of trouble. Understand that. Get to the golden information and knowledge. Have a solid understanding of why things work, why things don't work, how to truly get this, how to truly get that, how to understand your contracts and your applications correctly. You ain't out there wondering and, 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 and loosey goosing. You know what's going on in life. Welcome to at least six figures. Okay, welcome to at least six figures. You already know the number. I say it enough time. Research that if you can't find it. Watch some old videos. I said it enough. I ain't saying it no more. I may put it in the description. Period. But I don't got time for people to waste time. I don't got time for you. Unfortunately, I don't got time for you. I don't got time for you. You don't got time for you. You got to understand there's a real person inside of you, but that fuck boy is in the way. He preventing you from success. He making you complain. He making you take shortcuts. He wants you to get something for free real quick. He wants you to take shortcuts so you don't got to figure it out. Just have somebody else do it for me so I can win. That's what the fuck boy and you telling you. But it ain't easy being cheesy. You got to put in the work. You got to do everything that's possible. You got to fill out that application from A to Z. Period. Because once you do that, the success is abundance. Once you master it, and now all the stuff that used to be difficult is now standard. It's easy. Oh, I always do it that way. Oh, I do my taxes just in case I'm going to get out of it anyway. I love getting out of it. I'm on point that much. Audit me. Check it out. Run a check. It's OG style. Because that's standard information. That's the golden knowledge. I'm on golden time. Hmm? I'm on golden time. Period. Those who know, know what's up. Salutes to you. Again, trade lines. It's only a couple that you need. You understand? You need about five. The more, the better. This, if you can afford it, the more, the better. The more you have, the thicker you are, the more things are going to come in. The more money you put out there, the more it's going to come in. It's, just, it's like a net when you're fishing. The bigger your net is the bigger the catch. So look at your net like money. If you put in, you know, $200, if you got a a $200 net, well, that's about this big. You're only going to catch goldfish. But if you put a couple thousand dollar net out there, now you can catch some sharks. Hmm? It's common sense. So remember, in life, on YouTube, Instagram, TikTok. It's always two people that your dough step. Which one are you? Hmm? Now, there's that alternative third person who's actually there to help you, who's actually there to shine a light in your life, who's actually there to give you some knowledge to help you. Yeah, it's a little bitter. It may not taste good, but it's healthy for you. It's what you need. It's called sweat, hard work, and exercise. It don't feel good, but it's best for you. It may not taste good when you first start, you know, start getting into the program, but it's good for you. It's healing you. It's lowering your blood pressure. It's clearing your arteries. It's brightening your mind, making you think better, giving you an understanding that, hey, I can do it. Hey, I am somebody, because you are somebody. You just misguided. We've been misguided way too long. It's time for the truth to come out. Your success is the truth. You the truth. You can do it. Even if you think you can, I'm telling you, you can. You just got to be guided correctly. The guiding light is talking to you in your ear hole. So it's time for you to listen. Fall in line and quit playing. It's your year. Get it done. You can get it done. Come together with people. Learn to try merge with people. Try merge your life. Try merge your information. Try merge your education. 
at least six figures. Welcome to the new at least six figures. Time to get your head out of your ass and get busy. Time to upgrade and stop doing that old played out nigga shit that doesn't work. Nigga, if you don't know by now, Master Bob is the shiz neat. We fixing to help you dumb ass, so sit tight, pay the fee, and get ready to get your wig pushed back.